What does rain sound like? And how can it be evoked on a musical instrument like the organ? What I like is the rainfall, creating gentle and murmuring sound. I enjoy the soft and delicate sound of a light rain. What I'm also into is heavy rain with its intense and overwhelming sound. I really love French organ music of the 20th century, especially Louis Vian with his colorful harmonies. For the recording, I chose an organ that also has a French character. My choice fell on an instrument from the organ builder Romanus Seifert and Son. As a teenager, I had several opportunities to play on an instrument from this company in the Cistercian Monastery in Bochum Stiepel and I liked it very much. In Goch, St. Mary Magdalene Church is happy to host an instrument built in 2015. Its French symphonic style with 42 stops and cathedral-like long reverb fits perfectly with my new organ piece, Epanchement. Soft flue pipes and colorful reeds are a delight for the listener's ears. Goch is located in North Rhine-Westphalia, right on the Dutch border. Although I live about 320 kilometers away, I was still able to play this wonderful instrument, thanks to the digital sample set created by Piotr Grabowski. Here you can see the four sections of the organ. Let's begin with a pedal, which has two 32 foot stops, three 16 foot stops, two 8 foot stops, one four foot stop and one reed, 16 foot, the bombard. The Grand Dog has a full um, principal chorus, additionally uh, one string stop and a flute. And if you want to use um, other flutes with the Grand Dog, for example the flute harmonique eight foot, you have to couple the solo division to the Grand Dog. Since uh, the Grand Dog has only one reed, the clarinet 8 foot, but there are further reeds in the solo section like basson, trompette and uh, the clairon 4 foot. 
the Reci Espressif on the second manual has uh, lots of beautiful stops. For example, the Corps de Nuit, the Viol de Gambe, and the Voix Celeste, eight foot. And uh, very beautiful Corps d'Harmonie, Trompette Harmonique, Passant au Bois, and uh, Voix Humaine. The flute harmonique eight foot, for example, represents a certain type of pipe construction. Here, the organ builder makes the pipe twice as long as necessary to produce the normal pitch. This would cause the pipe to speak an octave lower, but however, because the pipes are designed for overblowing with the help of a small hole drilled into the metal, they speak one octave higher. For example, an 8-foot stop has the length of a 16-foot stop, but the pitch still equals that of an 8-foot stop. This type of construction leads to a relatively loud sound with amazing beauty, qualifying the harmonic stop as both a solo stop and as part of mixed ensembles like the Fond d'Orc. Now this ciphered organ in Goch has um, several harmonic stops, not only the flute harmonique in the solo, but also the flute octaviante in the récit, and as part of the cornet, the nazar harmonique and the tierce harmonique, so you can play these stops separately. Now, thank you very much for watching this video. Please don't forget to follow this channel and to turn on the bell. I wish you a silent and blessed Advent time, full of light and hope.